What's going on guys? D1 here, October 1st, 2015, and I am super excited to be filming this video. Um, for those of you that didn't catch my video yesterday, I went over kind of uh, the fact that I'm now building my, my brand publicly. Uh, beginning of the year, I had decided to do a zero to 100K challenge. Didn't feel like it really was congruent at the time. Uh, but now that things have kind of settled in and uh, I'm having so many people ask me, uh, you know, how do they really develop a blog or a business or a lifestyle brand? And I thought, you know what, it's it's about damn time I get out there and uh, and publicly build my brand. And you guys can just follow along. So what I wanted to do is take a snapshot of October 1st, kind of give you guys a lay of the land, exactly what's going on. Again, I don't really have a ton going on for my personal brand. And, uh, and I'm going to really show you guys as I launch this thing into the next, uh, into the next year. And, and, uh, ultimately I want to be replacing my income from my other businesses to be solely from myself. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip the script here. You guys are going to see, uh, kind of my web properties. I'll give you guys kind of a talk through of what's going on and, uh, I'll be filming two to three videos a week showing you guys kind of the changes and things that I'm implementing so that I can build my business as fast as possible. And again, the beauty is, is I'm gonna be as transparent as possible. Do you guys have any questions? Uh, I'm more than happy to share uh, kind of the behind the scenes and the mindset. But again, this is gonna be a, uh, a way for me to, to document the progress and hopefully inspire you guys. I mean, ultimately these videos are are here to to inspire, to educate, to empower you guys, to, to, to show you that it's 100% possible, that it's not just smoke and mirrors or BS, that it is 100% possible to take whatever you're passionate about and put it online. For me, my passions honestly is to help people that are stuck in their corporate jobs or, or you know, stuck in jobs they hate or situations that they hate and really live a life of full fulfillment and passion and vibrancy because it's possible and you can do it through your business. But anyways, let's flip over here. I'll hit my website and kind of give you guys a uh, behind the scenes. So you can see here, uh, as it is right now, it is still pretty bare bones. Uh, I actually don't have my opt-in up yet. It'll be something that'll be coming up shortly, which is going to be the perfect day. I'm actually going to show you guys as I build it uh, within the next couple days. Uh, got hello bar in the top, and this is just a plugin that you can enter your email and join my email list. Again, my email list is, is tiny for my personal brand. I think somewhere around 100 to 150 people. I'll double check that. Uh, layout is pretty uh, pretty bare bones right now. We have a little bit of an about me page and then some blog post information here. I do have a link to Kbook Promotions right now, which is the software company that I run. Um, but other than that, it is pretty bare bones. I think I might have about 20 to 25 blog posts. Most of them are just from YouTube videos that I have. Quite honestly, I am missing uh, some YouTube videos. So what I'm gonna be doing in the next couple days is just tidying it up so that my YouTube videos are now on here. But you can see, I mean, it's really bare bones. You know, I've got my About Me page here, really just some basic text. Uh, my resources page, uh, really not much. What I'll end up doing is I'm gonna end up doing reviews of all the products that I use personally. And uh, one of the income streams that I'll absolutely be doing is affiliate marketing. And again, just a Coles note on affiliate marketing. Basically, I promote other people's products, things that I would recommend, and, uh, and I get a commission for it. This is an amazing way to start your internet marketing career. Uh, without having to get into product creation, though I think product creation is the number one way to make money online. Uh, affiliate marketing is uh, is a great stepping stone. Now, full disclosure here, uh, I refuse to promote anything that I don't personally use. I think there's enough noise in the marketplace. So I will not be aggressively uh, affiliate marketing. Unless I'm using it, it won't be on my website. So that's pretty, uh, pretty plain. I know there's a lot of other people out there that are just uh, pumping product after product, and I think that's really unfair to to your email list and the relationship of your uh, of your readership. You know, um, so that's really it. And then my videos just go straight to my uh, my YouTube channel. So literally, guys, there's really not much here. Uh, things that need to improve. I need to get some sort of call to action set up here. Again, I've really just got the hello bar here, uh, but I'm gonna have a banner made up. I'm working with a graphic designer right now that will include not only the perfect day, but some sort of um, uh, you know, lead magnet or offer that's going to start the relationship with people that land my web onto my website. Now, for anybody that's creating a business, the ultimate thing that you're looking after is, is your customer relationship. And the best way that you can nurture it is through email. So by capturing emails, you're, you know, you're able to reach out to 100, 200, 500, 5,000, whatever the size of your email list, but you can reach out to those people immediately. And there's no better way to reach out to people than through email. So that's again, that's the blog. Again, pretty bare bones. 
Uh, I'll be making some immediate changes tomorrow and I'll be recording videos on kind of those changes. Um, I'm currently using Optimize Press as the theme and I've got a couple other plugins. If you guys wanna know what the plugins are, just leave a comment and I'll be sure to throw it up on the resources page. Uh, now let's move on to my Instagram. You can see I don't really have a whole lot of followers, 391 followers. I am in the process, actually, we just, uh, we're, we're starting a campaign while we're putting out quotes and, and really developing my Instagram. Uh, I can film a video on that. Uh, but again, only 391 followers, I've got about 234 posts. Most of it's lifestyle stuff. You can see I'm drinking a beer here. Uh, but it'll be a, uh, it'll be a mix of, of quotes and inspiration and, and really leveraging Instagram as a platform that it is. Um, so you'll be seeing a lot more of posts like this. Uh, I'm, I'm in the process of figuring out a hashtag strategy so that I can start getting more likes and more followers. Um, I would love to get some feedback on that. If any of you guys are Instagram, uh, users and, uh, feel free to follow me at D1 Bainey. Uh, you guys can kind of see the, the strategy that I'm using. Uh, I know it's a lofty goal, but I'm looking for 5,000 followers in the next 90 days. And I think it's completely possible. And the end goal will be to obviously drive people back to my website so that I can start giving them even more value. Uh, going on to Twitter, I honestly don't tweet a ton. Um, again, I only have about 195 followers. Uh, most of this is just me sharing from my, my Instagram feed and just hitting the share button. Uh, but one of my buddies, Dave Koziel and, uh, and Steve Rakin, these guys are up on Periscope right now and it's really starting to interest me. So uh, you may see me on Twitter a lot more and, and just doing Periscopes of, uh, of kind of in the moment stuff. So look for this to increase, but it will not be my main priority to grow my Twitter followers uh, within the next 90 days. Uh, moving on to Facebook here, and I do have an okay amount of followers. I got about 2,200 or so. Um, you know, on average, I get about, I don't know, 10 to 15 people per week uh, hitting like on me. Again, this is gonna change. Uh, originally, it was much more uh, music focused, but as as I move my my message to lifestyle design and, and living your passions, uh, it won't just be music. So I'm in the process of restructuring, getting my my design done here. Again, I'm working with a graphic designer to get that done. This will have a very clear call to action to come join our tribe, which is in the Digital Lifestyle Bootcamp. Um, and I can actually just pull that up here quickly. Digital Lifestyle Bootcamp. So we're sitting at just under 100 members right now. I think I launched this about a week ago and uh, actually 113 members. It's growing pretty quickly, actually. I'm getting about 15 to 20 people uh, every day that are looking to join. Uh, this is gonna be my Facebook group where I'm gonna be able to connect with people on a one-to-one on -one basis. Uh, you know, join our tribe, people that are passionate about uh, you know, becoming thought leaders or entrepreneurs within their marketplace. This is gonna be the hub for them. Uh, but again, about 113 members. And then onto the YouTube, and this is kind of uh, this has kind of been my bread and butter. Now, to be quite honest, I haven't really been releasing a ton of videos, but I've got videos that have really just um, taken off for me. So what I can do, uh, you can see right now, I've got 3150 subscribers there. Let me just see if I can go to my analytics quickly and kind of give you guys a um, sorry, give me 30 seconds here. And give you guys a snapshot of kind of what's going on here. So here's my analytics. Uh, I've chosen not to run any ads on my on my videos, and the reason why, and, and I mean I could be right or wrong at this point, is for the amount of money that you're making on clicks. I don't think it's worth people being uh, redirected from my YouTube channel. I want them to be on my channel. Um, so you can see, just in the last 28 days, I've had 34,000 views. Uh, you know, 303,000 minutes watched. And if I was to increase that from, um, you know, let's just do Q3 as a kind of nice indication of what's going on. Uh, 110,000 views and, um, you know, 964,000 minutes of watch. It's actually pretty crazy. And, uh, you know, if you don't put out videos, you don't consistently get uh, more people watching. But... I'm gonna actually record all of these down and it'll be a nice snapshot to see for Q4, so October, November, December, and see kind of the results that we're getting. So ultimately guys, this is kind of the snapshot. Uh, I'm going to be doing my goals video tomorrow, uh, going out to the beach and probably recording it. Really give you guys a, a, a behind the scenes uh, snapshot of what I feel 
uh, needs to happen within my business, kind of the goals that I'm giving myself, and more importantly, the the stepping stones to go. And uh, if you're building your own business kind of alongside me, this is a great opportunity to to join in on the conversation. You know, I've made some amazing friends in the last year or so, just just as peers or, or you know, coaching students have now turned into peers that are also growing their businesses. So this is an exciting time. If you want to jump on, have questions about growing your business as well, I'm more than happy to talk about it, maybe even have you on my channel. Uh, so I'm going to upload this video, guys, and uh, and get back to work on uh, on some other stuff I got going on. But expect a video tomorrow on my goals. And, uh, and if you guys have any feedback, let me know, guys. I'm open book for you. Talk soon.